Greetings, everyone. This is Jeff of On Your Oath Civil Rights Investigations. Today is Wednesday, November 17th, 2021. I am standing in on the public sidewalk in front of Gulf Breeze High School in Gulf Breeze, Florida, conducting a First Amendment audit and a civil rights investigation. I will be holding my God bless the homeless veteran sign out here on the public sidewalk and saying God bless the homeless veterans uh, to see if the Gulf Breeze Police Department and the uh, school system here respects our right to freedom of speech, freedom of religion, freedom of assembly on public property. We'll see how it goes. Gulf Breeze 9-1, do you need police, fire, ambulance? Hi, how you doing? Um, I got uh, a police. Okay, where do you need the police? Okay, so it, it's not immediate, but I would like to send some uh, an officer to be sent out uh, across from the Gulf Breeze High School, uh, almost directly across from Gulf Winds Credit Union and Gulf Breeze High School. I think it's uh, I forget the name of this road, but it's right directly across from the high school and Gulf Winds Credit Union. Okay. Um, on the cor on the corner there, I think it's Daniels, right on the corner, you know, like almost across from also. I'm I'm familiar from, with where uh, you're talking about. What's going on there? Okay, there's a there's a bum panhandler guy. I don't know what you call him. He's in a black hoodie. He's got a big sign up that says, you know, give me give me whatever. But the problem is that we, I just dropped my kid off at school, and he's asking the, the the middle school and high school kids for stuff. I mean, he's he he's on the school grounds. He's directly right. He's walking right now as we speak, directly across from Gulf Winds and the Gulf Breeze High School, and. Honestly, I don't care if he needs, you know, if he's panhandling, but he shouldn't be doing it on the high school grounds. He's making the high school kids uncomfortable. Okay, I will. Uh, I'll send an officer actually, over actually, there. I'm what is? Him right now. What is? He actually, he actually, he's directly in front of the Gulf Winds Credit Union right now, and he okay. can walk right back onto the high school grounds. What is your name? My name's Matt. All right, Matt. I will have an officer there here in just a minute. Thank you. I appreciate it. How you doing, my man? All right. How are you, sir? Good. Got reports that you're soliciting for money. God bless the homeless veterans. Right. Uh, City of Gulf Breeze has an ordinance. Cannot solicit for funds or anything like that without a permit and prior vetting from City Hall. Mm -hmm. Have you done that? God bless the homeless veterans. God bless the homeless veterans. Have you been to City Hall yet? God bless the homeless veterans. Okay. If you continue this... God bless the homeless veterans. Okay. I will continue it. Okay. I will be right here as long as I please. Uncooperative. What's your name? David Eskridge. All right. My name is Jeff. I'm the school resource officer. Yeah, Jeff. But you are... Uh, negative. But you are violating city ordinance. No, I'm not. And how do you know you're not? I uh, know I'm not. It's up to you to find that out. I already know. I've been doing this for 20 years. I'm very familiar with the city yeah. ordinances. And you are required to have a permit and prior vetting by City Hall mm -hmm. in order to solicit for funds in the city. Well, God bless you anyway, sir. Okay. Well, I'm staying you right here. Well, you won't be for long. I, I mean, will you'll be. You'll be headed to jail. <laughs> you think so? Yeah. You think that? Uh, you think you I better? I mean, it's an arrestable offense. It's second, second degree wanna, misdemeanor. You might want to do a little more, bit more investigation to see if no, I'm soliciting or not. I don't have to do that. Because I'm not soliciting. Okay, well, I've got several people that say you did ask them for money, especially our students. Nope, never happened. Okay. All right. So why would they lie to me? I don't know. You have to ask them, not me. No, I'm asking you. They're lying to you. Okay, no, they're not. They wouldn't have any reason to. That's not a reasonable assumption. Morning, sir. God bless the homeless yeah. veterans. Hey, how are you? you? Good. So as long as you're not asking for funds or money from them, mm -hmm. all right, we I mean, perhaps we can take it for granted at this time, but if another report comes in after our discussion, yeah. well, then that's a done deal. But standing here and God blessing the veterans, that's perfectly fine. Mm -hmm. It's once you start soliciting for funds or step off the sidewalk into the right of way, that's when you've created the problem. Mm -hmm. Does that make more sense? God bless the homeless veterans. Does that make more sense? God bless the homeless veterans. Do you intentionally just be impertinent? God bless the homeless veterans. Is that veterans. what your goal what's, is? What's impertinent about saying God bless the homeless veterans? Nothing. Okay. But not answering my questions. I'm just coming out here and talking to you. Well, God bless homeless veterans, sir. Have a nice day. You're dismissed. I'm not leaving. Have a nice day. Yeah, this is my territory. Be gone. Yeah, no. Shoot. No. Bye-bye. No.
can stand here just like you. You can, but yeah. you're bothering me, so. Oh, well, bye -bye. tough. Life sucks, doesn't it? <laughs> sucks for you. No. Anyway, I don't want to get into back and forth with you about it. I just want to say well, God bless him. Clearly you do, because you've already started that. Um, you're the one that approached me, not, not the other way around. We had reports that he was soliciting or approaching the kids as they were coming on campus. He says he's not. I don't have any reason to doubt him, okay? But explain to him that once he does, he's violated the ordinance. He wants to, I mean, apparently he's making a YouTube video and he wants to become famous on YouTube. So they're just fine. I've been on YouTube before and I'll be on it again. I'm already famous on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah, it's <laughs> Don't doubt that. But anyways, just... But if you guys did want to see my ID, I got it in my pocket right here. Is that okay? Yeah, I could care less who you are. Right. Here is my I, and there's my D. Oh, and he's a comedian. Ah. Okay, just... <laughs> he just, thought it was funny. Just make sure you don't good. come on campus, okay? Well, what if I need to come on campus for official business? You don't have any business. Do you have a student here? Do you have uh are you like do you are you like the know it all czar? Yeah, I'm the resource officer. You like the know it all czar. You know whether well, this, I would have official yeah. business out here. You magically know if I'm soliciting or not. See, you came out here with the wrong attitude. See, had you listened, you would have noticed I asked a question, not made a statement. You came no, you came out here with the wrong attitude. Yeah. You you came out here, you said you are you're out here soliciting. So check your attitude. So that's learn a little bit from, that's the report I've got. Learn a little bit and from I don't this need experience. a lecture from the likes of you either. Learn a little bit from this experience. No. It sounds like you do. Twenty years no. you're you're, don't need you're a pretty lecture sorry from for the an officer. Of you. I've dealt with you. Twenty people, years of an officer. Like you before. Twenty years of, as an no officer. Difference to me whatsoever, you what you absolutely have to don't know what you're doing. So the point is so you can learn a little bit. You don't come on campus because I am a officially trespassing you from campus okay okay all right so just make sure that doesn't happen so you're officially trespassed for what reason because you have no official business on campus i have if no you, official business if on you campus. have no student that goes to the attend school here then you have no business on so campus. so there's no reason that i could that i would have official business come on campus if you make a prior if, appointment yeah if i have like yeah. if i was making a public record request or something individual. like that yeah, no, that doesn't come to the school. That goes to the district. It goes to wherever the records are located. No, the public records See, request See, again, go to the 20 district. years as an officer and you're ignorant. Yeah. <laughs> 20 years as an officer. It's best for you to go I, on about your business because you're making a fool out of yourself. Yeah, I sure am. Yeah? So, yeah, if you want to make a public request, public records request, you have to send that to the district. The nope. district is the only people I can come right it. here on this, this and campus. And you will not get them. And I'll make a public records request to the district here at the campus for records that are here and at the campus. And you will not get them. Okay. So, good luck with that, <laughs> sunshine. All right, y'all have a good one. Yeah. I